We are back home um, from the family wedding that we drove up to the Bay Area for. And today is going to be kind of all over the place. Uh, the apartment is a mess. Our like bags and like all my stuff is all over the place. So I wanna clean today. Um, I have to work on um, a couple edits for projects that were technically due today, but I, I turned them in like late last week. Um, so I didn't have to worry about it when I was with my family. And then I want to edit everything that I filmed over the weekend. I want to drop off the roll of film that I also shot when I was in San Francisco. And we also have to get groceries because we have no more food in the apartment because uh, we've been gone a few days. And I don't know what else. What else do we have to do? Uh, drop off film? I think I said that already. No. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> um, but I'm, I'm not sure what else is on the agenda today um, but I think I might just leave all like the work stuff to the end of the night because it's too dark to film anyway once it gets to that point um, so I think we're gonna take care of the errands drop off the film and whatever else I said before then today's outfit is very simple it's just this striped long sleeve kind of like mock neck shirt and then some black corduroy pants and then my Doc Martin shoes. I usually wear this shirt every year around the holidays. It just makes me feel really festive because it's like one of the only like long sleeve shirts that I own. Uh, the weather's kind of like in the 60s, which is very chilly for Californians. <laughs> so I've been holding on to this baby for years. I think it's like from 2017. It's super soft and worn in at this point. It's just like one of my holiday staples. haircut I think she cut off I want to say like two inches and then gave it a little bit of shaping at least it doesn't look super dead and dry and stringy now uh, I wish I would have gotten my haircut for my cousin's wedding I wanted to but I really just didn't have the time um, but I do have a few things going on for the rest of the month uh, so tonight I'm taking my brother out to dinner because today is his actual birthday and then tomorrow I have a PR event I'm not really sure what to expect for that tomorrow, but at least my hair is presentable.
good. It's just spicy tuna with a little bit of spicy mayo, some green onions over rice. It looks so delicious. The smoothie that I had was definitely not enough. So I'm gonna eat this and then get ready and we're gonna go to LA. So. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Friday and I'm all bundled up because it was very cold today very cold this morning uh, we went on a little nature walk Raleigh and I have been trying to at least you know get in a little bit of a hike kind of like a nature brisk walk at least once a week yesterday was really just a work day and I ended up just going through all the footage that I filmed over the course of the week and then I got some um, campaign reach outs, very last minute holiday campaigns that I think I'm gonna work on. So I was just kind of like waiting for the contracts on that, kind of doing like my own final edits on other stuff that I had already turned in. So yes, yesterday was just at the laptop kind of day, all day. Um, and then I didn't really get to talk about it before. Uh, I filmed very, very little of it, but on Wednesday I went to a PR event. It was essentially just kind of like a product showcase put on by a PR agency that I work with pretty often called Be Social. Uh, so they just had a bunch of their brands that they represent there, and some of the owners, the marketing people for some of those brands were there. And um, I got to take some stuff home. There are a lot of other like content creators and influencers there. So they kind of let us pick out the stuff that we wanted to try out, stuff that interested us. And then I like to take that opportunity to kind of strike up a conversation um, with um, the people there. And I immediately <laughs> started talking uh, to the guy that was serving coffee. Uh, he was really cool. He ended up giving me a matcha latte with CBD in it. There was another display right next to him for the CBD products that he was using. And so I just talked to her and she gave me these like gummies to try out. And yeah, like I said, the next day I just worked. 
I have some other holiday stuff coming up. And then today is really kind of just a rest day. We did our nature walk. I think I might work a little bit more. And then my brother's coming over later because I'm gonna puppy sit this weekend. I'm gonna puppy sit his dog, Allie. I don't know if we're gonna get down to anything today. I was thinking maybe we'll go see some Christmas lights. I'm just like in the mood to see some Christmas lights, but I think we might save that for another day. Maybe I'll save it for another vlog and make it kind of like the focus because uh, this vlog has kind of been just a very realistic, normal week in my life. Uh, so it's about kind of winding down a little past lunchtime. I think I'm gonna get back to work. And then, yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog here because the rest of the day, I think I'm just gonna be working. Maybe we'll watch a movie um, while we're puppy sitting Allie. And yeah, I'm gonna kind of just get ready for the weekend. I do have some ideas. I was thinking maybe I'll make some like holiday drinks to kind of like, warm you up. Me being very cold this morning kind of got me in the mood to maybe make another drink video. So I might do something like that. It's supposed to rain this weekend as well, which I'm very excited about. We don't really get a lot of rain. Just want to uh, chat a little bit with you before I end the vlog here. Hope you've been enjoying these. I've kind of been enjoying making them. Um, I don't really vlog this much, like uh, especially because I took that long break. But thank you for watching. If you've made it this far, I will continue to make these <laughs> until Christmas, I think. And I'll talk to you later. Bye. Thank you.